welcome all of you to this video in the name of Jesus Christ today we are going to see a topic that is it is woe to the false teachers who are misleading the people without knowing the truth of the word this is the topic it is woe to the false teachers who are misleading the people without knowing the truth of the world. I think you understood the matter. Without knowing the truth, following untruth, thinking that it is truth of the world, following that untruth, they do not know what is truth, but they are following untruth, thinking that that is truth of the world, worshipping it, following it and they will teach that untruth to other people of the world and these false teachers will mislead the other people of the world. For them it is woe. That is the meaning of the topic. I think you understood the matter. There is truth in the world without knowing that truth certain teachers false prophets they follow untruth not truth opposite of truth that is untruth or the satan opposite of god opposite power of god satan they will follow satan thinking that that is truth but they do not know that is untruth and they will spread the their knowledge regarding their God that is untruth or Satan to other people of the world and mislead those people in the world. Such type of teachers, false prophets and teachers, false teachers, it is woe for them. I think you understood the matter. We can see a reference from the Bible in this matter. The verse is taken from the book of Matthew, chapter 24, verse 24. Matthew, it is the book of Matthew, chapter 24, verse 24. 24, 24. For there shall arise false Christs and false prophets and shall show great signs and wonders in so much that if it were possible they shall deceive the very elect in the last days of the world false Christs and false prophets will appear in different parts of the world and they will mislead many people of the world these are false prophets and false Christs, not true Christ. See, Christ already he came and he went. Next time Christ will come from the sky and not from the earth. Christ will not come from the earth again. Remember, keep it in your mind. Jesus Christ will not come from the earth. Already he came. He lived and he finished his mission and he resurrected after death. He, he was crucified, he was killed, he was buried, he was resurrected. He resurrected from the dead and he went, uh, ascended to heaven. Again he will come on the last day of the world for the judgment of the people of the world. He will not come from the earth again. The second time when he comes, he comes from the sky. All the people of the world can see him that he is coming through the sky. He will not come from the earth. Keep it in your mind. False Christs will come from the earth and will cheat you, will deceive you, many, many people of the world. Be careful. Christ will not come from the earth again. 
he will come from heaven through sky his coming all the people of the world can see his coming in in the second time at the end of the world and when he comes from heaven through sky before his coming trumpets will sound in the sky three times trumpets will sound in the sky ah uh, this the sound of the trumpets will be heard all over the world all the people of the world can hear the sounds of the trumpets which are blown in the sky these terrible and horrible sounds of the trumpets will be a warning to the people of the world all the people of the world can hear the sounds of the trumpet on the last day of the world it is a warning that jesus christ is coming many people will not understand it many people will not identify that jesus christ is coming but without knowing the reality many millions of people of the world they will blink and look at the sky from where they heard the terrible and horrible sounds of the trumpet they do not know what is happening in the sky many millions of people will roam here and there what ha what happened in the world what happened in the sky without knowing what is it what sound is it they will look at the sky shocked people will look like shocked and they will look at the sky what is that sound why i am talking this thing to you because i i had seen a vision god has given a vision for me regarding this in the, the happenings of the last day of the world in that vision i have seen the sounding of the trumpets in the sky and after the sounding of the trumpets jesus christ appeared in the sky with many saints and angels in the sky with beautiful clothes robes beautiful colorful robes wearing robes the saints and angels jesus christ also appeared there in the sky i i have i have seen this vision i have seen these this scene in a vision god has given me a vision in which he showed me all the things what are the things going to happen on the last day of the world that is why i am talk, talking to you firmly regarding this matter before the coming of jesus christ from heaven on the last day of the world trumpets will be sounded in the sky three times it will be sounded it is the aim of the sounding of the trumpets in the sky is to alert to the people of the world that he is coming jesus christ is coming to the world for the judgment of the world to make the people alert the sound and the trumpets are sounded in the sky three times these trumpets are sounded its sound will be terrible and horrible whole world can hear all the people of the world can hear the sounds of the trumpet on that day such a tremendous horrible terrible terrific sound the appearance in the sky at that time after the trumpets these uh, saints so angels and jesus appeared on the sky the sky was beautiful skin beautiful seen with colorful dresses tingling i can't explain i can't describe it in my words words are not sufficient to describe the coming of jesus christ on the last day of the world no words to explain no words to describe the scene which i had seen in a vision on that day therefore i tell you don't believe the people false prophets false christs they say that they are 
they will say that they are Christ. They are Christ's. And they, these false prophets will say that they are prophets. Don't believe them. Jesus Christ will not come from the earth. He will come from the sky. Beware. Keep it in your mind. Jesus Christ will come from the sky only, not from the earth again. Because, because he is in heaven now. He has to come down from heaven. He will come through the sky, not from the earth. Beware. People will come and cheat you. People will come and mislead you. People will come and deceive you. Be, be careful. Be alert. Matthew chapter 24 verse 24 For there shall arise false Christs and false prophets and it shall show great signs and wonders in so much that if it were possible they shall deceive the very elect. Even the elected people or chosen people of Christ the people who are following Jesus Christ in the world today Christians selected people chosen people of Christ. Even these false prophets and false Christs will come and mislead, deceive the elected people of Christ in the world. Be careful. Even the Christians will be cheated. Even the Christians will be followers of Christ, will be believers of Christ, will be deceived by these false prophets and false Christs of the world who are going to come or who are appeared in the world today. Be careful. Another verse we can see from the Bible, Mark 13, chapter 13, verse 5 and 6. Jesus said, Watch out that no one deceives you. Many will come in my name, claiming, I am he, and will deceive many. Here, Jesus said, be careful. Watch out that no one deceives you. Be careful that no one deceives you. Many, many false Christs and false prophets will come and deceive you. Cheat you. Be careful. Be alert. Many will come in my name claiming I am he. Many persons will come in the name of Jesus Christ and saying that I am he. I am Jesus. Like this, they will say and they will cheat many people of the world to be careful and will deceive many. I shall tell you one incident. In the in Russia, few months back, I saw a video in YouTube. In Russia, a person appeared uh, disguised as Jesus Christ, making his appearance like Jesus Christ, growing his... Uh, growing his hair, growing his beard and wearing a robe like Jesus Christ, gown like Jesus Christ, looks like he looks like Jesus Christ. Such a appearance he has created, made himself and he said that he is Jesus Christ to the, to the people of that day, province. Many, 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 many thousands of people gathered the to see Jesus Christ on, he will appear on the top of a mountain and all the people of that province will come to that area and they will gather down on the valley of that mountain. When all the people gathered there, he will appear in the top of the mountain looking like, a, look, look, looking like a Jesus and claiming that he is Jesus, acting like Jesus wearing dress like Jesus, um, uh, having hair in head, on uh, hair on his head like Jesus. He has grown his hair like Jesus and beard also like Jesus, looks like Jesus. He disguised like, uh, like Jesus and he cheats many, many, many thousands of people of that province in Russia. Finally, some people, they gave information to the police secretly regarding him. He is a false Christ. Understanding it? Some people in Russia informed the police. Police came and arrested him and took him away. False Christ appeared in Russia. Okay. 
I have I, I, I have seen this video in YouTube on YouTube I have seen this video that's why I'm talking to you the same matter happened in the world in Russia it took place like this mm. okay next and will deceive many people of the world be careful another words we can see from the Bible mark 13 verse 22 for false messiahs and false prophets will appear and perform signs and wonders to deceive if possible even the elect the false Christs and false prophets will appear in the world and will cheat many people of the world even the elected ones or believers of Christ will be cheated by these false prophets and false Christs in the world be careful be alert be alert things will happen in the world in the end days of the world all these things will happen in other words Luke 21 in the book of Luke chapter 21 verse 8 Jesus said don't let anyone mislead you for many will come in my name claiming I am the Messiah and saying the time has come but don't believe them many people will come in the name of Jesus Christ and false prophets saying that I am Messiah Jesus is the Messiah these people fraud fraud persons they will they will say to the people that I am Messiah that Jesus Christ I am the Jesus Christ saying that I am Jesus Christ people will appear and mislead people of believers of Christ even the elected people or chosen people of the of Christ will be cheated deceived misled be careful some other words taken from the book of Matthew chapter 24 verse 4 and 5 Jesus said watch out that no one deceives you for many will come in my name claiming I am the Messiah and will deceive many the same message okay so be careful persons will appear in the end days of the world saying that I am Christ I am Messiah and many false prophets will appear and cheat many thousands of many millions of people of Christ believe believers of Christ so so all these all the people who are following Christ or believers of Christ must be careful be alert not only that one more thing I want to say in this video that is beware of human gods in the world many persons will appear in the world saying that they are gods no man can become God no man can become God many persons will come and say that they are gods these are cheating work of the Satan be careful many people many fraudulent teachers of from different religions will come and say tell you Jesus is not God Jesus is only a prophet Jesus is not uh, not a uh, not a uh, or, or real God like they will give false ideas regarding Jesus and destroy the personality of Jesus Christ be careful destroy spoil the personality of Jesus Christ saying that he is he was born in the wrong way such a type of bad information they will pass and twist the faith of the Christians and also others and prevent the prevent the people those who are ready to come to believe Jesus Christ these things are the work of the Satan in the world in the end of the world you must be alert and you must be careful these false teachers prophets of uh, prophets from different religions they will come and say that Jesus is not God and Jesus is not a prophet and some people they will say that Jesus is only a prophet not God they will confuse you they will destroy your faith they will break your faith they will divert you divert you from the faith of faith on Jesus Christ they will divert your faith on Jesus Christ from Jesus Christ your faith will be diverted to somebody else some false gods that is the main aim of the Satan the Satan is working behind these false teachers and false prophets of the world in different religions so that be careful
persons teachers false teachers false prophets will come from different religions and say that jesus is not god jesus is not a prophet or they will say jesus jesus is only a prophet and they will say sometimes they will say jesus is born jesus was born in the wrong way not on the right way and many many explanations they will give some people they will they will say from other religion they will come and say jesus did not die he was not crucified he did not die for the sins of the mankind of the people of the world they will confuse your faith they will confuse your belief in jesus christ they will divert to your faith from jesus christ be careful be alert